Damian Lewis from Fresh Sports Nation here at Sandy Creek High School for a little action under the lights for you Friday night. Region opener for the Sandy Creek Patriots playing host of the LaGrange Grangers. And after LaGrange struck first, first play of the game, in fact, it would be 27 unanswered points for the Patriots. They pick up the 27-7 win. What a night for Caleb Hill, quarterback for the Patriots, finishing with two touchdowns, one on the ground and one through the air. And running back Amari Latimer with two rushing touchdowns himself. Let's check out some of the action. Picking up in the first quarter. Patriots in the hole as is the Grange on top, 7-0. Second and goal for Sandy Creek and Amari Latimer going to punch it in for the score. Patriots miss on the extra point attempt and they trail 7-6 later in the quarter. Another big run here by Latimer up the middle and then he's going to bounce it to the outside and the Grangers got to get him down by any means necessary and on the very next play it's going to be Caleb Hill dropping back he sees a lot of real estate, so Hill takes off, dives into the end zone for the score. They go for the two-point conversion and complete it. It's a 14-7 lead for Sandy Creek. Both teams relatively quiet in the second quarter until 24 seconds to go in the half. And it's going to be Hill dropping back, Hill going deep, and Corey Hadley Jr. with the catch. Give me that. At the extra point, Patriots up 21-7. Third quarter. Latimer picking up his second rushing touchdown, second and goal for the Patriots. And he won't be denied as he punches it in. They missed the extra point attempt, but it would be a 27-7 lead. And that would be your final score. Here's head coach Darius Smiley on the lights out play by the defense. Our defense has been good all year. You know, hopefully we can continue to play lights out on defense. And uh, we just didn't do a good job of tackling tonight, man. And we got to be better. You know, hopefully we can, you know, use this off week to kind of heal up and get some guys back and, and uh, continue pushing forward. Offensively, great game on the ground for Amari tonight. Got to be proud of the guys up front, obviously helping him get that done. Yeah, uh, I, I thought we were sloppy up front. We didn't, we didn't come off the ball. We didn't establish the line of scrimmage. Amari's just a beast, man. And you know, it's, it's when you got a kid like that in the backfield, you just, you know, you try to hand it to him and let him do his thing, man. But you know, some of those, th some of those runs he makes on his own. You know, so uh, I thought we didn't, we didn't play as well as I felt like we should have up front. But you know, we got some guys to make some plays behind it, and uh, Caleb did a good job on, on the uh, right before the half to put us up two scores, man, and, I, you know, just proud of them for doing what they needed to do to get the win, so, you know, and it is what it is. We're going to try to get healthy, use this bye week, and uh, get ready for ups and leaps. All right, once again, that final score, 27-7. Sandy Creek picks up the win in the region opener over LaGrange and improved to 3-0 on the season. From Sandy Creek High School, I'm Damian Lewis with Prep Sports Nation.